two, one, go. Did you ever have a doubt? You threw your Did halfway you ever down ever the damn court. Doubt? Did you ever you have a doubt? You threw your hit the ground to her rear. <laughs> Yours didn't even make it. What's well, because I didn't like throw mine. What else is new? Jesse's last one. Oh, man. Yeah, whatever. We are back from our big trip. Everybody's, is everybody healthy? Somewhat? Yeah, <laughs> healthy enough. Define healthy, huh? According to the CDC. Yeah, according to the CDC, we are all good to go to get back to work. We're not, uh, just go ahead and tell everybody right off the rip here, we're not racing this weekend coming up. Um, got some other things going on, and then uh, if y'all hadn't heard, we had a little bout with COVID. Like I said, everybody's good though. According to the CDC. So anyway, we will be having a weekend off of racing coming up, but we got to get unloaded from our big trip here up to the Midwest. The Midwest swing is finally complete. We are we've been back home for a little bit, but we're finally able to get out here and get unloaded and cleaned up. Because as you can imagine, with almost three weeks on the road, we got a mess accumulated. Let her rip. So we had announced that we were going to go race at Paducah International Raceway last Friday night. I know the 10,000 win independent race there, unsanctioned race. But on the way there from Wisconsin, we had ran at Fairbury in Illinois, went to Cedar Lake and Gondic Law in Wisconsin. And on the way back south from Gondic Law, had, like I said, a little outbreak of COVID. Couldn't make it to uh, Paducah. We apologize to anybody that uh, made plans because we were going uh, really would have liked to have been there, but we just felt the best thing to do was to go ahead and come home and get healthy. Hip! Hey, we went through some tires. On yeah, I hate to know. I might have to go add up our tire bill. It was uh, astounding. It'll be astronomical. Yeah, but hey, you gotta do it. You gotta do it. So the goal for today is to get started unloading. Got the new car. We gotta name that thing here eventually. We'll do that. Probably not today, but soon. So what'd you change for Gondic? <laughs> <laughs> hey, I, I think, you know, can't really, can't really We'll tell you off camera, buddy. <laughs> hey, we found something. Found something. We'll put Jesse in. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's what it was. So Jordan's back with us. He was on a trip. Can we tell everybody where you went? I may have already told him. Savannah, yeah. Georgia, how did you enjoy it? Yeah. 10 for 10 it. recommend? 10 yeah. out of 10. Yeah, there you go. I'll take a trip to Savannah. That's actually a place me and Shadow have wanted to go for a while. Been to Charleston, but never Savannah. Like there's a park bench with Forrest Gump actually sitting there, and that's pretty cool. He's you still sit? there? Forrest? Yeah. Wow. He's still got his chocolates. Ease her down. So yeah, Betty's gonna stay in there, I guess, for the time being. We'll probably we'll probably get her out for Eldora, don't you think? Maybe. I don't know. Ain't got a whole bunch of room around here. All right. Good to be home, boys. So coming off of a somewhat disappointing run at Fairbury, definitely disappointing at Fairbury. Weren't any good there at all. Cedar Lake, we were a little better. Um, ended up in the show, but then obviously Gondic Law, we were a lot better. That's what uh, Jordan was asking. That's why Jordan was asking, what in the world did y'all change? while he was on vacation. So uh, a lot better there at Gondick Law with the XR Super Series with a fifth and an eighth place finish.
we have fast forwarded a whole day and before we can do anything else whoa 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 we have got to figure out which one of these is the fastest <laughs> i can go ahead and tell y'all who's gonna win this deal yeah, yeah, yeah. all right so we have more of our pullback cars in stock we got some a while back these have been hard to get we've been trying to get them for a while project x race cards got us hooked up got some a few weeks ago posted about it on facebook and they were sold out like two hours later so we finally got some more and they are online right now go and get you pullback car we're gonna race them real quick because i think mine's faster than joseph's and jesse's nope we're gonna start back tires must be on the crack and it's first to get to the grass right uh -huh. no bumping no wrecking no him and no hauling yes <laughs> you can't like throw it halfway down that no way. you just gotta we'll push just, it you gotta just give it a nice right. little gentle go pull it back to the crack, gotta be back on the crack. Back, back tires, back on, tires the on it. All right, who's going? All right, Jordan. Give Three, us a countdown. Three, two, one, go. <laughs> Did y'all ever have a down? You threw your. <laughs> Did y'all ever have a down? You threw your Did halfway you down the damn court. Down. Did you ever? You threw your shit hit the ground to a rear. <laughs> Yours didn't even make it. <laughs> What's well, because I didn't like throw mine. What else is new? Jesse's last one. Oh man, yeah, whatever. You, this is what you just did. No, it wasn't. <laughs> okay, that didn't work. <laughs> okay, y'all can get these online. HTFmerch.com to get your pullback car. We got the 56, we got the 10, we got the one. And if you want to get your own race car made into a pullback car, you can get with the fine folks at Project X Race Cards to get your own car made into a pullback car. The info for that is in the description of the video. Thanks to Project X Race Cards for getting us hooked up with some more pullback cards. Y'all can get them at HTFmerch.com while supplies last. Anyway, now that we got that, situation taken care of we're going we haven't cranked this in we like to crank the motors up after we wash them we haven't done that yet since jordan washed this one yesterday and i think we're gonna go ahead and change the oil in this thing since it's due for that yeah it is due it is due dude all right you oh, good yeah. yeah i heard that i really heard it down. Down. primed up this one this stuff don't move anyway no wonder, that don't even move i wonder if this being strapped to that Put any extra stress on it. So that was the piece, our last night at Gondic Law, that was what broke, right? Yep. Yeah. That cracked. We had a rust change carburetors to hot light. Luckily, we found that piece. Who'd you borrow that piece from? Overton? Right Overton. Well, you owe him an elbow. <laughs> yeah. Like an elbow, elbow, you know? Give him elbow going in turn one. <laughs> yeah. Here's your elbow back, bub. Appreciate you. you remember that <laughs> elbow I owe you? <laughs> <laughs> but this is the new engine. Well, it's new and it's got, a, I don't even know how many races on it now. But it's the one we bolted in this car when everything was new going to Eldora. The J. Dickens engine, Mr. Mark Langenfelder bought for us. We did put a new carburetor we slipped on there and didn't tell y'all about. That's how we had the other one to bolt on. Good thing we did. Good thing? No doubt. Good thing. thing. Oh, you didn't know about that, did you? He was getting ready. We cranked the car. Fuel going everywhere. And there was fuel leaking out here. I thought it was just, you know, loose right here. So I went to go just try to just tighten it a little bit, and it snapped right in half on this middle of this elbow. Wow. So we yeah, had to, like, crazy. hurry up, shut it see what, ha see what happens when you leave us, Jordan? You're getting nothing about me. No, not evidently not. So this is actually a bigger carburetor than we had been running. Before Fairbury, we put this carb on. And now we got a little more horsepower after, with it. No, after yeah, after after, after yeah. Fairbury. Okay, we got a little more car, uh, horsepower with it, and then we got the other one in the trailer still that we were originally running with this engine. Are you ready? On. 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 Ready? On. He wasn't ready. He was not ready. <laughs> Just spin it for a little bit.
Okay, that was quick. Can't let her be getting all hot on us. We're gonna change the oil. Change the oil. Tell you what, y'all change that oil. I'll calculate how many lapses on this thing. All right, you do does that. Shanta says it's brand new. It's actually I keep saying the new half, engine, but it's half wore out. Yeah, well, that's a good idea, Judge. Go add it up. You're supposed to have that like, you know, weekly. Yeah, like right here on the piece of no, tape. No, we will. Okay. Well, we gotta moving go forward. So moving y'all get this. I'll yeah. get that. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Uh huh. When's the last time we changed the oil? And I feel like we've done that pretty before recent. Before we left. Oh, right. before I, we changed the oil before we went and run the. Before we went to Fairbury. Before we went to yeah. Fairbury. Yeah. Oh. Is it hot? No. I don't pretty know cool. it's gonna be hot. Thank you. Don't worry about. Oh, oh Jordan! No, oh, Jordan! Let it go! Let it go! You just gotta let it go. Yeah, that's a mess. It overfilled last time I did this. That's, that's because why I, if that if them holes are. I you sort must of have had way, one time. Stopped up. One time I was changing the oil in a crate motor and it overfilled and you know the crate motor ain't got that much oil in it but there was bees that had gotten in there, died, and clogged the holes. The hole. <laughs> Craziest thing I'd seen in a while. Yeah. Well, good thing that wasn't on our new floor at the new shop. You know what I mean? Yeah, Whoo, you got her figured up? Got her figured up. Whereabouts are we? All right, hold bad. on, first of all, Tell me, dog. how many laps, <laughs> how bad is it How bad is it? Dog? How many laps were we supposed to run this thing? Between before uh, it goes back in to be freshened 1200. up, twelve hundred laps. Yep. When you get one, that's I think a common number. Yep. Uh, when you get one done, new, fresh, whatever, twelve hundred laps goes back in. What is it? Seven or eight thousand to freshen one up. Seven to ten. Eight to ten. Yeah. All right. So where where are we on that track? We're halfway home, boys. Five sixty-five. Five hundred sixty-five laps. Is that now that one hundred percent exact, is that or is that pretty well like as best I can figure? Count hot laps, about like five hundred sixty-five yeah. laps. So yeah. we're halfway to needing a freshen up. The question is, and we've only had it since five sixty-five. Five sixty-five. Five sixty-five. Yeah. So, bigger question is, can we make it to the end of the year without being lapped out? Here it is. Uh, got halfway June. through August. You got a lot of racing late in the year. Yeah, we should be okay. How many laps are we gonna put on it at our door? It's new, it's so that's <laughs> if I can get fourteen hundred. I don't know. Yeah. I don't know. <laughs> that's how we want to. I think we'll make it. We might have to pull out the backup car, the yeah. Betty with the Dell engine, and make you know run some races with it. Maybe. Oh, we got the drain still. Yeah, we got the drain. Yeah, that's okay. Nice we forgot. Okay, we're 600. Oh, we're over halfway. Joseph yeah. forgot our practice Plus night at Boyd's. 40 at Boyd's. There you go. That's 600. 605. Halfway right home. Side, boys. Oh, oh, man. Hey, every lap counts. 605. Okay, I like this. We're going to start doing this weekly now? Yeah. All right, y'all stay on top of us. That way y'all can keep up with it. And we can keep up with it. But there's where we are as of... Is that today's date? Yep. Okay, there's where we are. 605 laps on our new engine. The other concern here would be the valve springs on this thing. We're not to the point where they need changing yet. We did adjust them. We adjusted them before leaving here for Fairbury. Now we need to repeat steps going through whatever that was. Prime it. Pull the cap off, switch on, fire it up. Okay, you're good. You're good. I've seen someone that's kind of Someone's done the math on that. It, yeah. it, I don't know if I want to see it, I honestly. 
As far as our next race goes, I know the next event on our schedule is the Cletus and Cars at Bristol Motor Speedway, where one of us, have we decided who's driving the Crown Vic yet? Yeah, I won the... Yeah, <laughs> Joseph won the pullback car race, should that count? Who should drive the Crown Vic at um, Cletus McFarland's uh, big... Uh, crown vic race at bristol motor speedway y'all let us know should uh should that have counted and goats would be our driver either way it's coming up labor day weekend we'll be racing the like i said the crown vic the bristol 1000 part of the event but you also got the huge burnout competition stadium trucks are supposed to be there it's going to be big y'all come see us you can get your tickets the link is in the description uh, where you can get your tickets for that after that we'll be going to eldora for the world 100 wednesday through Saturday, the weekend after Labor Day. So that'll be fun. And between now and then, I imagine we're not racing this weekend, but we'll look at next weekend and possibly do something. Stay tuned for updates on that. Don't forget to get your pullback car on hdfmerch.com and check out Project X Race Cards. Link is in the description. If you want to get your own car made into a pullback car, you can get in touch with those guys. Thanks for watching. Like, comment, subscribe. We'll see y'all later.